Let's talk a little bit about skin pressure injuries in people with IDD. So what is a skin pressure injury? Um, you probably have heard the term maybe pressure ulcer or decubitus ulcer or a bed sore. So this is what we're talking about when we're talking about pressure injuries. Why do they occur? Well, if you think about it, you know, tissues need blood for oxygen and for, nutri and for nutrients to get to it, right? But if you press on something really hard in a particular area, you're not going to get the blood flow that was once there. So the tissue begins to de deteriorate and it can begin to die. And that can result in what we call a pressure injury. So there are different stages of pressure injuries, uh, different ways to look at them um, and to assess how serious they are. And they can actually be deceiving. Sometimes um, something that looks relatively mild can have a lot of deep tissue injury that you can't always see. So the first thing we need to know is, is really what they are to be aware that sometimes people with IDD, especially if they have movement issues, may be more prone to pressure injuries. So let's start there and then we will take a little bit more deeper dive into this on future episodes.